Two of the greatest speeches ever given in this country were the Gettysburg Address by Abraham Lincoln and the I Have a Dream speech by Martin Luther King. Excuse me a minute. This is where he stood and gave that famous speech. Black men and white men. All you have is an etching in the concrete. There's no plaque, there's no sign. Millions of people trample all over that, not even realizing how important that spot is. He says, I have a dream. I call this stepping on the dream. I'm Daryl Davis. I'm a musician, actor, author, and a lecturer. People always say to me, Daryl, how can you have this stuff? Why don't you burn it? As shameful as it is, you don't burn our history, regardless of the good, the bad, and the ugly. And the Ku Klux Klan is as American as baseball, apple pie, and Chevrolet. Hey, Frank. How you doing, man? Hey, Gary. Nice to meet you. My pleasure. Here's my great Titan, Rube. Let me put it on? Yeah. We've got members as young as 18, and we also have junior clan members. We would fight to the last bullet for our people. Okay, so what can we all do together as a nation? Help Get save the white race. Help save the white race. On this gracious great ball of fire. How can you hate me when you don't even know me? Look at me and tell me to my face why you would lynch me. This country has been through a lot. It still has a long ways to go. Uh, an awful long way, as news will tell you. I'm mad. We should all be mad. We have a society that has determined that we should fear the black man. Give that person a platform. Allow them to air their views, and people will reciprocate. <laughs> I never set out to convert anybody. In my quest, some of them ended up converting themselves. Hey, this is somebody I can relate to. Yeah.